Well, hey everyone, it's Coach Megan. I am back on the podcast this week and I am so excited to bring back one of the most requested types of episodes. So actually the most downloaded episode, I think of all time, it's at least in the top three, is when we did the mock interview. And so today we are going to do that again. Some of you guys are gearing up, preparing for local season again. You've had a month off since a lot of your pageants and you want to get back in the swing of things. So today we are going to focus on a little bit different kind of question, not so much political questions, because again, if you are 10 months out, 12 months out from your pageant, it's just not necessary for you to be catching up on all the current events unless, you know, you really want to, um, or of course, unless your pageant is like tomorrow. But if you're still two months out, three months out, it is the most important part of pageant prep. Um, Although, of course, if you want to sign up for pageants and politics, it's an amazing resource and I highly recommend it. Um, But today we're going to be focusing on kind of those out there questions, the ones that aren't necessarily platform based, the ones that aren't necessarily um, bio hobby based, but they they make you think they're a little bit more creative um, and untraditional. So we're going to focus on those today. And today we are going to focus on the 30 second question, because these aren't questions, again, that are too softball but they're also not the questions that you are going to primarily want to share for a minute, minute and a half. And this will also help you to be succinct in your answers, specifically if you are of the USA organization or pageants with um, shorter interviews. So enjoy this today, my friends. Thank you so much for listening and a way that you can help us out in exchange for this being free to you is share this with five of your best friends or share this with five friends who aren't even in pageants but you think it'd be hilarious to hear them answer these questions maybe some dinner table conversation you feel me i'm definitely asking my dad these questions it'll be super fun so thanks for listening to this episode um you guys are going to get to hear from coach Allie soon as we integrate her more into the powerhouse podcast and uh, send us a message if you have listened to all over a hundred episodes now we have a few of you who have have completed all of the episodes and kind of wear it like a banner. Um, so we might send you something kind of fun. But anyways, um, yeah, enjoy this episode. I have enjoyed it. And uh, tell me how the questions go. Okay, y'all. So we're going to do this just like last time. I'm going to give you the question and then you can either pause this if you need more time, but I will give you a solid 30 seconds in between each of these questions and you can practice it in your car. You can practice it when you're doing your hair in the morning, I do not care. But this is a wonderful, wonderful practice for you guys to kind of get this timing into your belt. And again, send this to some friends that you want to see succeed or that you just think it'd be hilarious to put them on a timer and show them what we actually do. So, uh, okay, we're going to dive right in with question one. Where do you like to go out to eat? Question two, could you live without internet? And if so, what would you spend your time doing? Question three, tell me about your most memorable birthday. Question four, when and where are you your happiest?
Question 5. Other than your platform or anything that you mentioned on your bio, what is something else that you could teach me about? Question six, what has been the most life-changing experience of your days so far? Question seven, do you believe in luck? Question eight, what's the most useful thing you personally own? Question nine, what is your spirit animal? Question 10. What's the first thing that you notice about a person? Question 11. What three habits do you think that every person should deploy in their life? Question 12. What makes you laugh the most? Question 13. What was your upbringing like?
Question 14. What have you learned from past relationships? Question 15. If you had to compare yourself to one fictional character, who would it be and why? Question 16. What is your silliest or most irrational fear? Question 17. Have you ever made a split-second decision that ended up changing your entire life? Question 18. What is your favorite thing about being a woman? Question 19. What is the worst combination of ingredients you could ever put on a pizza that other people like? And last question, question number 20, who are you really? And that is our time. Well, thank you so much, everyone, for listening to this awesome episode of the podcast. Share, share, share this with a friend or tell us on Instagram at Powerhouse Pageantry which question stumped you the most, which question you liked the most. We'd love for you to do a screenshot and tag us in it so that we can be along on your journey. We can't wait to see you again next week. We are going to announce some very exciting dates soon for the next Powerhouse Fall Mastermind. Yes, it is already here. 
I don't know about y'all, but I can't believe it's already the end of July. It is absolutely insane. School is almost starting again. I'm like, oh my gosh, no, that means the weather is not going to be warm in like two months. So we've got to soak up every single day. But anyways, love you guys so much. Thanks for listening to the podcast and we'll see you next week. Hey guys, Coach Megan here, and thank you so much for listening to this episode of the Powerhouse Podcast. We're so honored to have you wherever you are, near or far away from the great metropolis of Omaha, Nebraska, where we are from. We are so proud to be your virtual coaches. If you could just share this with a friend that you feel like needs to hear this today, give us a five-star review if you haven't already, and click that link below in our show notes. We promise we are the nicest people. We are the nicest people, we promise, and we'd love to meet you, and we'd love to to figure out if you're a good fit for our programs or make a suggestion for a different coach, different consultant, different person that's a professional in their field that can help you. Um, the reason why we do it this way, actually, because a lot of people ask is because we want to help you practice the elements of being a great title holder from the very beginning. And one of those things is vulnerability. One of those things is being a self-starter. One of those things is being able to reach out and cold email, cold call, cold DM somebody that you don't know because of the potential opportunity on the other side of things. When I was missing around, Nebraska and Miss Nebraska USA, just letting y'all know that's how you get media. That's how you get appearances. That's how you get sponsors is being willing to put yourself out there. And so we want to help you practice that from the very beginning, learn more about you and discover um, if we can help you and we'll point you in the right direction for one of our services programs and the right coach for you. Otherwise, we will absolutely make a best suggestion for you in a different direction. Because at the end of the day, we're not territorial about needing to coach every person in the world. We just want you to find your right fit so that you can make your dreams come true and unlock the winner within you. Anyways, just wanted to encourage you guys in that today. Again, leave us a review, DM us um, on Instagram at any of our handles. And with that, we'll see you guys next week.